covering areas that aren't covered anywhere else in our community. These type of sub subjects are normally covered in private conventions where it costs five, seven hundred dollars, a thousand dollars and more to get into. Basically pricing you out of that type of information. So what Brother Siddiqui has done on his own battlefield, the battlefield of psychological war, this is what this is, he's done plenty of research, plenty of designated research, what I would call it, because this is not something that most of our people not only are interested in or even know about. So you have to even open your eyes and your mind to even understand his titles, because we don't deal with this type of stuff normally, but this stuff deals with us. And so he's showing you how we're the prototype and how everything that we're dealing with in technology is using us and has used us as prototypes and what the plan going forward, forward would be concerning us. Are they getting you ready for Jesus? A holographic Jesus? Are they getting you ready for a holographic character for terrorism? Are they getting you ready for holographic aliens? Is this what's happening? Right now, there is an attempt to emulate your consciousness. However you wanna look at it or define it, your consciousness, whether your soul, your innate essence, your spirit, your feelings, your vibration, your frequency, all of it. The attempt is to mimic it. Why? Why would Western science want to mimic your soul or attempt to mimic your soul? If you have a soul, why would you need to create one or attempt to mimic one or recreate one? 